Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. You can see I'm dressed in like semi professional clothes today. This is what, like, the kind of dress I go for when I'm actually doing something exciting and with a brand. So, without further ado, today we are welcoming. We are welcoming the lovely Nina and her husband. She is the creator of the Facebook group. Some of you might follow. It's Fancy Footwork Poles and Grids. And she basically comes up with the most elaborate pole formations, pole exercises and like grid exercises that you've ever seen. Like they're insane. You need to go over to her Facebook or Instagram page and you can see an example. I'll try and pop some up. But like really, really cool pole work exercises, not just poles in a straight line. So she is coming over because she works with the lovely poly jumps. Like I am so, so blessed to work with, as you can see on the t-shirt there. So she's coming and we are going to have an absolute blast in the arena and set up loads of fun pole work and grid exercises and take the ponies through it. And hopefully it'll inspire you guys at home to maybe give them a go. So that is the plan of the day. Have you seen Brinny's back? Will that vlog have gone out yet? Yeah, I don't know, my brain has actually gone to mush. Um, but another super exciting thing is that I have managed to find an incredibly talented drone drone guy, a drone man. I don't know what the, what the correct terminology is, an aerial videographer. That sounds quite fancy, we could call him that. His name is Rob Hemming and he has an Instagram page, 2020 underscore visuals. I'll pop it up because the first 20 is numbers, the second 20 is words, very clever. Um, yeah, I put a post out looking for someone to help with drone shots because I thought it would look incredible seeing these pole exercises from the air. And he very kindly got back to me and he's also coming today to get some aerial shots. I'm so excited to actually be able to put that footage in this vlog. Anyway, I'm currently down by the arena because mum said there was a rail out because the ponies go out in the field next to it. And I'm looking at it now and it's quite catastrophic. <laughs> it's not just a little rail that's loose. I'll, uh, I'll come and show you in a second. <laughs> so this is the ponies field and this is where Winnie and Brinny are out at the minute. And they're so naughty. <laughs> so firstly, my beautiful Voltaire design banner has been a little bit dishevelled, shall we say. I did think when I put this here, that's a mistake. And now it's really flappy. It was really taut. They're so naughty. Anyway, so they've done that and then they've come along and they have absolutely annihilated this railing. <laughs> hey, go on dad, hurry up. <laughs> You're gonna wanna change out your nice stripy jumper. Look at my parents both in stripes. Look at them. That's actually, that's shameful. I'm gonna pan away from that. But look at that rail. That's horrendous. That's not just loosening one. Ah, oh, it's never ending. Anyway, Dad is very kindly going to hammer that in for me. The arena is looking gorgeous as well. We harrowed it the other day with the car. We um we need to get something better to harrow it with because you're not really meant to put like the big truck on here because it's a bit heavy. Anyway, so excited. We're gonna wait for Nina to arrive. I'm gonna help her set up. I'll introduce you guys and then Rob's gonna come a little bit later, get some drone shots and ride the ponies. See how they go through these exciting grids and pole work exercises. We've got a very fun skinny grid that I believe we're doing and I think I'll do it with Dee because it looked quite difficult. Labourers have arrived. That's James you can see there and the lovely Nina who I'm not going to disturb too much because she's currently doing a spider in the middle of the arena. It's all going a bit over my head, but honestly, watching her work, incredible. And then we have got Jo, who's very kindly here to take some photos. So I'm going to actually help and set up some poles, give you a little, little look at what we're doing here, guys. Look at that. I mean, it's going to look so much better from the air and once it's all done. 
I'll keep you posted. Watching the master work here. <laughs> It is slave labour, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, do you pay your husband? <laughs> so this is what we've got so far. Okay. We're going to add some skinny poles, I believe. It's looking rather fancy. I don't know what Dee's going to think of this. This is Dee's exercise. I've told Nina that she really rushes through her pole exercises. So we're going to try and slow her down with these kind of spooky angled poles just to make her think a little bit more but we'll uh, pick Nina's brains about what to do if your pony particularly rushes through poles. So exercise number one behind okay. me. So you need it to be straight. <laughs> it's just a never ending battle to try and get it straight. But I've just given you guys a little fly through. James is actually placing these cones by all of the poles. So this is because when the horses go through, inevitably they're gonna knock some poles, move them but if you put all the cones at the end, then it's kind of like a marker for where you need to put the poles back to. So a top tip from Nina there. Anyway, this is exercise one. We are gonna lower it a bit for Dee to go through. We've just been chuckling at the fact that Bear would probably die if she walked in and saw this exercise. <laughs> Have you got a name for this one, Nina? This is just the centerline challenge. The centerline challenge. Right, I'm gonna get a pony. Having a little pep talk with Dee Dee because it is rather confusing out there. Hey Dee Dee, <gasps> got my beautiful Volta Design saddle, which I can actually now shout and scream about also. Put my stunning new leathers on and look at that stamp. Oh, oh, just love it. Right, okay. Pole work time. Gonna hand over to Hobbit. Say hi, Hob. Hey. Okie dokie, Dee Dee is all warmed up. Hobbs has just gone to let Robin with the drone. So that's hence why I'm doing a little piece to camera now. But we're just going to walk through the exercise initially just to let Dee Dee have a look at everything and then we'll start building it up and getting going. So that's the difficult thing, Meg. Coming from those skinnies to that point is a really, really sort of big ask for her. Yeah. So let's come one more time. Lovely through there, good. Yeah, super. Very, very good. Awesome, good job. Okay, let her walk and have a little stretch. And uh, we've got lovely Rob from 2020 Visuals, Hello. who Hi, is uh, <laughs> hopefully going to be capturing some of the lovely pole work clinic. Dee Dee's up there watching takeoff. <laughs> right, you ready? You ready? Oh, well, this is the exciting bit. Oh my goodness! <laughs> I can't see Dee really. Dee is like, what is that? <laughs> right, I'll go back to the arena and uh, capture Dee's reactions. Another good reason to not a bear out here. <laughs> Dee think it's a big buzzy thing that's going to sting her. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Sounds like a swarm of flies. Yeah. <laughs> Good girls. Good girl. Bless her. Very good. Yeah, well done. Oh, perfect. And the key focus is the straightness that anything with a point that she trots into and out of, nice and straight. <laughs> Lovely, good. Very good, well done. Let's come one more time. She thinks there's a swarm of flies and she's been stung this morning, bless her. She's not a happy bunny. Good girl. And then we'll start to change it again. Brilliant turn. Down the spooky long side of Ed. There's so much going on for her. <laughs> She's being amazing. Brilliant. Good job. Walk and have a breather. So it's lovely that even though the tempo is changing a little as she sort of feels that she's got to just go a little quicker to sort of get the distance, yeah. the rhythm is just staying the same the whole time. So good really good job. So this is interesting. Two you wait till it gets raised on those poly jumps. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Yeah, we ain't done yet, Mum. <laughs> so Nina's just saying that ideally we want D not to step outside of these two little triangles meeting. Yeah, oh, good, good girl. Well done. Brilliantly ridden, Meg. Very well <laughs> Can she do it in trot? <laughs> that is the question. So if you're happy to come through in trot, come through. If yeah. you want to go through a walk again, that's absolutely fine. Whatever you think she needs. Very good. Super duper. So just come through one more time. Yeah. So she just needs a fraction more uh, acceleration, just coming to the last skinny pole to commit her to the distance to that last diamond. It's hard, isn't it? Because you want to take the speed away to keep straight, Absolutely, but you have yeah. to be quite bold to go with your <laughs> strides. <Straight. laughs> you want to forward. Yeah, good. Yeah, very good. <laughs> good girl. Okay, walk and breathe up. Well done, Dee Dee. This Didi. is a bit of a brain teaser from the Andy. <laughs> it's such a brilliant mental workout for them. Yeah. It's a really sort of, you know, mental as, a, as a well as a physical. It really sort of develops that agility. Yeah. That is a raised pole. It's not a jump. We'll just stare you a little. He's like, can we her? Good, well done. <laughs> she, forgot, she forgot about those ones. <laughs> so keep coming. I'm so pleased with herself getting over the first one. She forgot her last. That's much oh, better. lovely. So, Nina actually, we lowered that and made it a little bit wider so that Dee didn't feel trapped or claustrophobic. Dee's very happy that Nina's so tuned in to what she's saying. I 
really, she's having a lovely time. <laughs> she? she says, I'm good at it, it's all right, we can do it. Oh, yeah, we, we can, can carry on. <laughs> yeah. So now we're raised in and out of this little uh, triangle, I guess it is. Let's see what Didi makes of this. When she was in there, she was like, oh, is it going to get me? Oh, rubbish turn. Oh, well done. You're happy with her? She's doing really well, isn't she? really well. Good girl. It's good to actually get her thinking. Yeah. She's like, oh, it touched me. <laughs> I think Dee's only concentrating on the raised ones at the end. <laughs> Go. A little bit quick. Excellent. It's okay. good for her, she's really having to think. All right. Oh, it's all gone to pot now. Cant has been introduced. <laughs> She's like a little pony. She's got a lovely so polite cute. canter. Very good. Okay, so just hang on a second. Let me just make them a little short. Okay. That was my fault. <laughs> Train. It's coming up quite tight now, isn't it? Coming up pretty yeah. quick. She's like, yeah. Because you'll run out of holes, otherwise, there'd be more in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so she wasn't ideal coming in, but she thought for herself and she sorted it out. Yeah, exactly. And I think I like it when they sort of get the counter poles wrong because then the next time they come round and hopefully they sort of thought, okay, so that happened last time, so this is what I need to do. So it's really good to sometimes just to leave them to get on with it and not micromanage and have well, it all exactly. perfect and actually allow them to make those mistakes and that's how they learn yeah this is why we didn't use there because she would <laughs> see that as a very big jump i think this would be oh ve God. very entertaining <laughs> oh she's having a little look good girl well done Meg. brilliant <laughs> joe's life flashed for her eyes then Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. One last time for Dee Dee. Okie dokie. So finished our first session. Dee Dee was an absolute star. I'm Good so, girl. so happy with her. But she is going to head out of the arena now. 
because Rob is gonna pretend to be a horse and fly the drone through at horse level to see, so you guys can see what it's kind of like for me riding. I don't wanna stay here, no. Ain't gonna keep it low now. If you wanna go, let's go. Let's wrap it up and hit the road. I just got an awesome vibe. Striking the wind up. Right. It's actually really hard to see the drone. You can kind of see it there. Oh wow, look at you go. So can you see it on there then? Oh my God, that is insane. That is gonna be such cool footage. Okie dokie, the team have been busy little bees, changing this up so Dora is the next pony to come out. Rather than try and film at my boring five foot six level, I'm going to pass over to Rob to show some drone footage of what we've set up for the next exercise. Okay, got Dora. We've got the drone. Where is the drone? I can never find it in the sky. Never really. Oh, it's somewhere up there, guys, I promise. Yeah. Dora's clocked it. But actually, doing okay at the minute. So we're going to film around the poles and then see if Dora can cope with Rob being above yeah. us yeah, as we ride. Yeah. He's crossed. Cool. She's been fine at the minute. Awesome She's just having her first. Oh, she says that banner's new. <laughs> that is new. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Well done. Good job. So Less tough. coordinated than D. That's <laughs> okay. Oh, she's a little puppy, isn't she? She is really sweet. Yeah, she's another one that's meant to be sold, but <laughs> Mum and I are like... Oh. <laughs> I can see habits forming here. <laughs> so just because they look okay one way around, they may not look the same the other way around to them. Look out. I can't believe I could just leave that. Incredible. James, you just get that pole for me. The third pole. Come on, James, you're better than that. Well, Poor James. Well, it, to be honest, Meg. I expected Joe oh, to do, but clearly <laughs> below her. <laughs> Very good, well done. Okay, let her walk and have a little breather. Very good, well done. Okay. This way. So the first three are fine, the corner's fine, but then she's slightly long to the next one down the long side. So if you could do it one more time. Okay, so Meg, just work on the circle down there for me. Thank you, thank you. We get one chance, one chance. so good with that banner. She is, Whereas isn't she? There's so much else going on. She's a bit like... Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah okay. she has. Good girl. Okay, just come on. So yeah, she's definitely just a little bit like, oh, she's Yeah, banner. she just, yeah. like, she wobbles, which changes the distances. But yes, it absolutely, yeah, alters her balance. So if you feel she needs a little bit more room, go more towards the outer side of the diagonal pole. Okay. If she needs a little bit less room, come to the inner. Uh-huh. But I could easily change that angle if it's a little bit too abrupt. <laughs> it's that banner. <laughs> She's like... <laughs> Actually, so don't let her get too quick. Well. Super, well done. Lovely. Oh, amazing. Oh, 
Good girl, oh. Dora. That's like about 20-ish poles, 20, 21 poles on me. Oh. On this surface, I'd like to say you can see how quickly they rack up. Little behind the scenes. Rob doing a cracking job through this exercise. Really nice elevation there through his feet. <laughs> Yeah, very good to get back into that rhythm. That's okay, she's just a little distracted, that's all. Good. The drone sped us up a little bit there. <laughs> oh. oh. Well done. Just keep looking at where you're going. Yeah, very good. Well done, May. I really got to use that outside leg. Amazing. No real difference, actually. Would have been a lot easier on one that knows what hand to leg is a bit more, but. <laughs> well done. Okay, she can have a little breather. Oh, she says, oh. I need one. Chin chin, guys. <laughs> so that's currently empty. Empty at the minute. Oh. So I can't be told off for spilling anything. At the minute. At yeah. the minute. <laughs> If you're good at it, you can have something in there. This is in the a... ultimate desensitisation for door, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Right. Can we do it and walk? You can do whatever you want to do it to start with. <laughs> uh, to start with. <laughs> practice holding this bad boy. Steady. Uh, so you just need a tiny little bit more trot to get through those distances. Oh, well done. <laughs> yeah, much better second half. Well done. It could be that she's just getting a little bit tired. Oh, it's not going to pop, it's Paul. Not gonna pop. <laughs> Nina's so confident in Meg's ability that we're going to give her Prosecco in her glass. A bottle of 1975 right. <laughs> 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 Oh, Dora says, Thank yes, you, please. <laughs> so we normally fill it up to the bottom. Oh, hello. Good um. girl. <laughs> oh, yes, that's okay. fine. I'll have all foam. <laughs> I said that foamed up very quickly. <laughs> don't we Good do, girl, don't we sit that on? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, I was going to say, if you want to just, you know, take the bubbles off anywhere yeah. you see fit. <laughs> Dora's like, there's something buzzy. I'm sure it's going to get my ears. Oh, okay. yeah, there's the drone. Good girl. Good girl. Cheers! <laughs> oh, that's lovely, that is. <laughs> nice refreshing. Chill to perfection. Oh go. my there goodness, go. that's, quite, right, guys. that's quite full. <laughs> oh, I don't want to spill this. <laughs> ah, can't short my reins. <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> Good girl. Oh, oh, it's alright, Dora, Dora, it's alright. Don't no, shake, no. don't shake. I honestly, it's not flies. Good girl. Right. Chin chin. Good luck. So, obviously, if she panics, just throw it. Okay. What? If she panics, just throw it. No. Or, or drink it quickly. If it pan yeah, if she panics, I'll just gulp. <laughs> Come on, baby. Oh. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling the pressure I'm really like. Should I go with my right hand? Is that going to be steadier? Sorry, Good but girl. we're having a last minute tactic. I just want to say this is the level of it now, so it's not completely full. Guys. Okay. So no, we're going to be told off at the end. <laughs> Right. I expected to lose a little bit of a miracle if you didn't. Good girl. Oh, no, I felt that first drip. Good girl. <laughs> Meg has got a steady hand. It's <laughs> all those years at uni with practice, I imagine. Yeah. Done. Good that, girl. That is that. impressive, Meg. <laughs> She's going to make a little mark as to where we it was. Were, we were just saying all your years at uni have not been wasted because you've got a steady drinking It's hat. years of camera work. <laughs> that, <laughs> there we go. I mean, I've got a couple of drips. That has hardly moved. That I'm is impressed. way better than we get in the clinic, isn't it?
yeah. Chin, chin, guys. You should come to a Prosecco challenge because you will win every time. Yeah. <laughs> a new career. <laughs> Always drink responsibly, all right? Well deserved. <laughs> Did someone just say best five-year-old ever? Literally, cannot believe how good she's been. So she's come out here. We've got photographer, we've got drone, we've got people she's never met before. The, like I said before, the Volte Design banners are uh, new up. None of them have seen that. We've got about a million poles and she's just been so good. I'm so impressed. So absolutely loved that serpentine exercise. Was very good at highlighting sort of how much Dora falls in on the corners because obviously when you come round this bit here, you can kind of really feel how much they fall in because you can work out at what point you're hitting your curved pole. So yeah, very, very good exercise. So now it is the fun exercise coming up, which is the jumping one with Jammy. Sneaky preview of what is to come. A skinny grid. Now these wings are obviously wider than the pole. So we're gonna let Jammy go through when they're wider, but look, that is really not, <laughs> not very wide for when we actually have it as jumps. But Jammy is now my badminton pony. Has that been announced on this channel? I don't know if it's been announced on the channel yet. Jamie's qualified for badminton. I can't think how these vlogs are going out because I've got a holiday plan. So I've literally planned my content for the next month. Um, but yeah, so it's good for her to have these kind of tricky exercises. Again, I'm not going to show too much on this camera because the drone is going to get impeccable footage. Honestly, guys, I've just had a look at the footage. It's in insane seriously go and follow 2020 underscore visuals on instagram because there is amazing content like it's just so nice to look it's so satisfying so those are farming stuff which i was gawping over for like best part of half an hour last night but yeah go follow okay whilst they're deliberating about whether they can uh, pick up a wing with some spiders on <laughs> i'm going to quickly tell you about the giveaway so all of the jumps we are going over today are of course my amazing sponsor Polly Jumps and they have very kindly offered a giveaway for today in the theme of pole work so we have got these lovely mini blocks up for grabs so we're going to do a set giveaway with them so you'll be getting six of these so you can do your raised poles you've obviously got the different height options on these ones we did use them for the first exercise if you were watching so you get six of these as well as three poles so you can do some lovely raised poles exercises and replicate some of the ones that we've been doing today so that giveaway will be live over on instagram once this vlog goes live Hopefully we'll get Joe to get some nice pictures and then I will uh, show you exactly what the set is and pop it up on the screen. But it's UK only that giveaway I'm afraid guys because we cannot post these big polls through the letterbox abroad as of yet. Um, but yeah, go over to my Instagram at elfic.event.ponies and enter that giveaway. Hobbit the queen of snacks. Oh, look at this. I splashed out one of the foxes on this morning because I thought they looked blooming delicious. I've got delicious. some cakes as well. Well, you've got some cakes. <laughs> Just going to move our little mini block. Look how cute it is. It's a little mini version of the other ones. It's so adorable. Oh, you'd be very lucky. This is what the six look like for the giveaway, guys. You can see they'll come packaged. They are the beautiful heritage colours. You'll be able to choose what colours you want, but heritage are my favourites. Tammy says, I am experienced with drones already. Says, I actually had a drone when we were filming Swipe Up Kick On with Horse and Country TV, so I'm not at all fast. <laughs> okay, Jamie, time to rock and roll. not phase at all now. All right, do you want to trot through a couple of times yep. and then we'll start to, to build it. <laughs> She's like, Somebody's keen. What's trot? <laughs> <laughs> so just come one more time. Alright, let's go. 
Good shot. Nice. Really smart. Wee! Oh, and changes. <laughs> oh, now we're showing off. Yeah, that wasn't um, intentional. Posh. <laughs> Ah, good girl, so just once more. Nice one, yeah, beautiful, good. Good girl. Yeah. The arena party building up this little grid of skinnies. Right, we've changed it slightly. We've gone for a little bounce up the top there. It was a one stride. Ooh, good girl. <laughs> Didn't see that coming, Jam. Good girl. <laughs> oh, we're trying again. Let's hope it's third time lucky. Oh, good girl, well done. He's really having to think. Just making that a tiny bit longer. <laughs> She's coming through quite boldly. Oh, oh super duper. Oh, I'm so glad we moved that. So 
That's amazing how it can just hover there. Crazy, isn't it? <laughs> there it goes through the jumps. I could see this being a new competition. <laughs> Drone jumping. <laughs> it doesn't really show up on the video very well. It looks this, yeah. Jamie's just had a little wash off after her jumping excursions, but we survived the skinny challenge. Managed it and we did bounces at the start, which apparently no one's ever done in history ever. So skinny bounces, try it at home guys. Anyway, we've just got our arena party clearing away here, bless him. And then I'm gonna try and persuade Nina to debrief on camera very quickly she's nodding her head she looks excited <laughs> um, and i will give you guys final details of firstly where you can find nina and where you can find 2020 visuals to follow them and yeah just get involved it's been a very fun day and i've learned lots as have the ponies they've worked very hard jammy is a sweaty girl bless her <laughs> nina's gone all, all shy because i'm forced her to be in the camera so sessions are all done all done we did our first, what did you call the first one? The centerline challenge. The centerline challenge. Then we did the serpentine challenge with Dora, with the Prosecco, which <laughs> I didn't spill too much of. Not Hardly a drop. Yeah, I was but quite the, impressed. You spill much less than most people do when it's water. Must be the incentive. It, 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 it literally <laughs> was, yeah. It's because I knew spill. I got to drink at the end of it. <laughs> um, and then we did our skinny challenge and we added the bounces in. Never done bounces before. Which was... A new one. It was tricky and it was also really tricky coming off that 10 tight turn. turn. Yes. Yeah. yeah. That was... the centre line. That Absolutely. was quite hard. <laughs> yeah. She agrees. She agrees. She agrees. Brittany, you can do it two years time yeah um but if you would like to follow the lovely nina and pick her brains on your incredible exercises we can find you at uh, fancy footwork oh. <laughs> fancyfootwork.co.uk <laughs> is the website or fancy footwork poles and grids on facebook and on instagram and on instagram yes and you're going to you know be good and you're going to start posting i'm going to post more on instagram yes meg i promise <laughs> yes meg yes meg. <laughs> this is the first time you've been like this it's been me submissive to you this whole time i <laughs> know put a camera there and it's terrifying it's right is there, is there anything else you'll say you good no that's fine <laughs> It? it wasn't that bad, was it? Well, it was, that was it. A that massive was right. thank you is what I've thank got to say you. to you. Know, no, thank you incredible. so much for having us. I mean, we've been here for hours and such an imposition and you've been amazing. No, it's been, I mean, it's great for the horses I to actually saying, work properly. I keep saying, she's like, off camera. It's like, oh, amazing. <laughs> you know, sometimes you never know if people put up a persona or not, but no, you're very definitely the no, same. I'm Both sides of the camera. Annoying, 24-7. And the one thing that I'm really impressed with is that I said to Joe that I can see why the brands work with you because you deliver every time always yeah. deliver that shot it's can we have amazing. a nice bit of music over amazing. this it's <laughs> <laughs> it's very, honestly very impressive oh, and i don't say you. that to me to creep around you i'm genuinely impressed yeah oh, she that's really kind no, she's she's not normally nice no. <laughs> yeah, oh so, amazing yeah, well lovely. we've had the best day <laughs> so have i yeah. and hopefully we're going to try and get nina back i've got exciting plans in my head Ooh. that we probably can't say in case they don't come off <laughs> and I'm throwing the brand under the bus but hopefully we'll get Nina back for some more exercises so this is a, shoot, this is a prize giving this is a prize giving work. Work. we should have made a little podium for you I, to was, stand on. I was thinking we could get the pulley jumps for like first second and third yes. so did she do one. well did she do well she Nina she was amazing Aww. so this one is the I survived the skinny grid Ooh. rosette I actually I did survive there were times you where I thought did, I wasn't going indeed. to but I did <laughs> <gasps> so who was the skinny grid? Jam. Jammy. That's Jam. Oh, well done, Jamie. And Jammy. then this one is for Dora for doing her serpentine prosecco challenge. Ooh, well done, Dora. Well done, Dora. <laughs> and this one for D for the centerline challenge. Absolutely Brilliant. smashing the centerline challenge. Oh, perfect. Thank well you. Done. Well done, you. Bit of a linked poly jump heritage colours there, guys. Absolutely love those <laughs> colours. <laughs> Yay! I'll bring my sweat patches. Yay! <laughs> well done, and thank you very thank much. God. Thank you so, you. so much. Oh. Literally, I just sat down to start editing things and doing some emails, and I was like, 
I've not done an outro. I just got too excited to go and look at footage. Hello, baby girl. Sorry, got distracted by my phone ringing. So, literally the best day another day where i just think i am so lucky to have this job i just oh, absolutely love it so the biggest thank you to everyone involved today nina you were absolutely incredible that is fancy footwork poles and grids if you guys want to follow she puts loads of posts up where you can see like really good pole exercises so i'd certainly recommend giving her a follow if you ever go out to ride and you're not feeling particularly inspired with your exercises because you'll be able to find loads on her page that you can try at home of course a massive thank you to james her husband for coming out and helping us with lots of pole moving <laughs> a big big thank you to joanna fair photography i'll be popping these names up guys if you'd like to give them a follow she was getting loads of beautiful shots so i'm sure you will see those on all of our Instagram pages. A big, big thank you to Rob and Charlotte for doing the drone footage. Oh my goodness, I've seen like tiny clips on Rob's phone and it looks insane. I hope you guys feel the same because you'll have seen it in this vlog. This vlog's probably like four hours long because none of the footage I'll be able to say goodbye to because it just looks incredible so thank you so so much that is 2020 underscore visuals if you would like to follow them on instagram i believe i've got a nice new hat <laughs> i'm gonna screenshot that day um i believe they're on youtube as well and then of course a big big thank you to my incredible sponsor poly jumps for providing all of the lovely jumps and poles that we used today remember there is that giveaway for the mini combi block set so you'll get six mini blocks and you'll get three poles that giveaway is uk only i'm afraid guys it's going to be run over on my instagram so do go and check that out once this vlog goes live i will get that live as well i think that's everything to say I wanted to quickly mention that Nina does lots of clinics and lessons. So if you follow her Facebook page and you're in the UK, <laughs> am I annoying you? Um, you could go over and actually have a lesson with her. She does them all over the place, I believe. So do check that out. But hopefully she's going to be back here. And anyone that's not in the UK, please don't touch my ears. Um, you'll be able to copy these exercises at home. So thank you so much. I've literally had the best day. I hope you've enjoyed watching, guys. They were some tricky exercises, but really got us thinking. And also, it's nice to just switch up a schooling session because sometimes when you're going out time after time, it can get a little bit repetitive. But today, it felt so different. It was like, I really, really, really enjoyed it. Anyway, I've now got the best outro ever from the drone. So, I live, laugh, love you, and enjoy this super cringy waving footage of me and Nina. Bye.